welcome to my channel if you're new welcome if you're not welcome back i just want to make a video following up on the video of explaining why um of my last video of what i do for my hair growth and i think someone thought that well my my hair has been short for like four years but in in reality for me my hair wasn't long long but it was to a point where I could twist it sometimes, but I was not always recording. And I guess I wanted to explain myself because I know that, you know, some people are going to be like, well, you're talking about how you grow your hair. But what I didn't mention is how I'm trying to grow my hair now because throughout the years, I've been going to like um, natural hair salons or salons. And a lot of the times, and that was at the very beginning of my natural hair journey, like the very beginning. I didn't know how to do my hair at the beginning. and and But the times I was saying about products that work, they were working. But also I had medical situations that made my hair, like, like I had medical situations that made my hair kind of, like, sometimes, like, some of the styles I would do or using too much heat made my hair kind of fall out or stuff happened to my hair, not to be short, but a lot of the times I would have scissors and I would be scissor happy. I just wanted to put that out there saying that I, um, like, I am i wasn't trying to mislead anybody of trying to say, oh, look how I grow my hair. I was just trying to show how I'm trying to have a journey of growing my hair more now, because basically what I'm trying to say is, I knew how to grow my hair, but a lot of the time I would do stuff that would make me have to cut it off because it's damaged. Like for instance, using a lot of high heat, like um, using a lot of high heat and going to salons a lot. Y'all didn't always see those styles because I wasn't always filming. But a lot of the time, I, I just refreshed my hair, so a lot of the time before my videos I wouldn't. And my hair shrinks up to where it looks like it's not a lot, but it could be a lot. I don't know if that makes any sense. I'm not trying to mislead anybody. I just wanted to make a statement saying um, that I wasn't trying to mislead anybody saying like, oh, look how I grow my hair and my hair's been short. By the way, my hair, like sometimes it, I could like, in one of my videos, like I guess that oatmeal shave, um, Shea Bowdy Wash video, I had my hair like twisted. It was twisted, but a lot of the times I would cut my hair because I did a lot of damage to it. I just wanted to put that out there, you know. And a lot of the time I kind of had like, um, like I, I, in the beginning of my natural hair journey, I was very heavy handed. My hair was like, I cut off like six inches of hair, over six inches of hair. My hair was a little like shoulder, like shoulder length. Um, and a lot of the times I must say, I did think and have a phase, phases of wanting shorter hair for a long time for a long time and I thought I wanted it and then when I thought like my hair was going through a lot I used a lot of heat and I damaged my hair a lot throughout but my, the products worked that I'm sharing with you guys but I mean I would do a lot that damaged my hair a lot but now I learned better like don't use a lot of heat and I had phases of wanting short hair like this but now when I shared how I um when I shared how I grow my hair is to, um, it's basically to, to share my journey of trying to grow it now and buy no scissors or clippers because that will get me to cut it and keep it this short. That's one thing I wanted to let y'all know. I just wanted to be, wanted to make a quick video telling y'all that. In those previous videos that I explained other things, I'm going to put it down below like, what I do to grow my hair video and me explaining the previous video of why I grow my hair and why it's short. I just want to explain it short and sweet and tell y'all, um, tell y'all why it's been short for so long. It's because I was scissor happy. I was using too much heat and break, my hair was breaking off. I was doing styles that were damaging. Like I had my hair, um, 
like cut very short like it was like up like a tapered cut and it was curly and bright red but then when y'all saw me it was orange <laughs> and then I my hair was like breaking off and my hair was falling out and and stuff and I had to cut my hair down to the black part but then it was too damaged and I had to cut it all off so I just wanted to tell y'all um to be specific and I had a short girl hair short hair phase where phase is where I always cut my hair down short but now I'm just just sharing what I do to grow my hair um to grow my hair um now and I'm not gonna buy scissors or anything for my hair because I want it to grow and not be scissor happy but I'm making this statement because someone said that made it insinuating that I, my hair has been cut short for so long it's been short but I just wanted to make a statement okay um, it's just to um, clear up whatever um, anybody would probably be like, like, you know, I've been on YouTube for four or five years with short hair and I just don't want it to be like sharing hair growth secrets of me doing it the whole time because I don't want to spread misinformation or, or, you know, I didn't want it to seem that I'm giving hair advice how to grow your hair and my hair hasn't looked, um, looked like it went too long to be long so I just wanted to to say why and the main reason why is I always was like I would be back and forth like I want short hair but I want it long but I want it but if I'm around scissors I just cut it a lot I just uh, that's the reason why it's been short so long because I've been indecisive of growing it <laughs> and using too much heat so I just wanted to let y'all know Thanks for watching. Like if you liked it, thumbs it up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to be notified by all the new videos I upload. Remember, love, knowledge, and laughter. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Okay, bye.